Morning folks, how are we doing? Are we alright? Well, day before we go France. Going it morning, finally, finally. Back up and running, touring. You see it's tins on tour, isn't it? So you've got to do a bit. Weather's looking grim though. Alright, it's been gorgeous all week, hasn't it? And it's looking grim, ready for, for us going away. And apparently it's going to be nice the day we come home. It's about right, isn't it? Anyway, as we said, faye has got a new lid. And we will show you that. As our barb. What we have done as well. We've invested in some side panniers. I know we said we wasn't going to do because we got soft luggage while we was at Peterborough Bike Show. But... It's just been playing on my mind because we've already got the racks fitted. We've got the GVE Trekker mat racks fitted, so we thought, oh, stuffy, let's get the uh, let's get the proper luggage. Ordered it yesterday from the uh, sports bike shop. It's coming today. It's coming at half two today. Overnight courier job. What do you think of that, folks? Just make it look a bit different. Some new stickers. And tins on tour. And fair. Eating again. Eating again. But because I run, I am allowed chocolate. You're the same colour as dog. <laughs> okay. That's the dog running that top speed. <laughs> anyway, folks, I'll show you this helmet. Don't look. Well, folks, let's have a look at this helmet. Finally come back. To be fair, it was ready last week. We just not had a chance to go and get it. We're going Peter Bike Show on that. But yeah, France tomorrow. When you're watching this, we'll be on our way there. Anyway, look at this. Is that bad boy? That's all right, isn't it, folks? A bit different. Fair's gonna model it or something like that. There we can see how nice you can breathe. <laughs> Is there anything like that, folks? Goes with Barb. Just nice and bold, isn't it? It's all right. Yeah. And as I said, we threw a... Uh, nope, wrong way around. Let's get you right way. Threw a sticker on there, up my guard. Outside the box. Oh, God, folks. I mentioned it yesterday on the Facebook page. I don't know if you can see down there, you can see a bloody car exhaust clamp. There's actually a good reason for that. A really good reason for that. Yeah. The reason for that, well, I think when we went up for breakfast, up Lancashire Way, up to Bull and Cafe, went for breakfast there, I did know, I was just messing with bikers, you do, and uh, I grabbed the exhaust, it was a bit, it seemed a bit loose, I thought, so why is that? Any road, as I showed you just where that car bracket is, I went in there, and the bracket that was on there, was too far up it weren't over there you know where the the joints are what you what, what compress in will make it clamp to the to the pipe itself well it wasn't over there so stripped it all down that's a bloody nightmare you know what heat shield obviously it's got a heat shield here it's got one there and there's a metal one underneath it 16 million clips for tech off well there's not about four took them off Tried tightening it up, one tight, it was tight as it'll go, and it was still loose, so the exhaust rattling. We got, like I said, we got France in the morning. We're leaving here at five o'clock in the morning. We got France Channel Tunnel. I'm full of a cold, folks. Sorry if I sound a bit grim. Of all times, never ill me, never ever ill, and no, going away. Got now we've got man flu. Fair's in despair. I was up at half past two this morning, sniffling a snotting, didn't go back to bed. Anyway, I digress. So, too late for get a proper clamp. There was the old one available, but it was too small. So I'm just that put that off for now. I've ordered one, so it is what it is, isn't it? And I will show you this now. The tamp bag. I have been asked how have we had that to fit on there. Because anybody that knows knows that doesn't fit on that on this bike. You have to have the uh, the Africa Twin, the Africa Twin at a specific bag, which is a bit big for me. I don't like it. I want something of that size. Just nice, just nice size that. Anyway, yeah, I'll show you how we got it for fit. Well, Jiffy tank bag, just perfect size that. Fits it off in, cameras, money, tickets, what have you. And it's very unobtrusive. You, when you're riding, you can't even see it. Can't even see it. But, whoever, like I say, if you've got these, you'll, you will know. 
for that though, that's uh, specific to the Africa Twin. And the bag that fits this is one of them. It starts there and comes down here and it looks a bit naff and I'm not a lover of them. It's too big. So for this one, if you'd have got it, it'd have been like that, which obviously is no good, is it? So what we did, spun that round, base plate, spun it round 90 degrees. And guess what? It was hit at bars, like everybody said. Said it doesn't fit. So what we did do, or what I did do, if you take that out of there, it doesn't, it's not the best of thing, is this, but it did the best. Take that out of there. I spun it around 90 degrees and moved it up as far as it'll go. So now when it goes on. Yeah, perfect. Doesn't sit. It's just a nice size, isn't it? Happy days. It's a bit of a pain getting to the thing for unclip it, but you can still do it and no big deal. So anyway folks, you'll be watching this tomorrow or Sunday. By this time tomorrow we'll be getting just be getting yeah, probably just be getting in France. I think we get the 11 o'clock train, we get in France for about half 11. Uh, I think the hour goes, no, the hour goes forward, so this will be uh, half 12 in France. And then we're going to go for a mooch. Uh, we are stopping. We was going to camp, but the weather looks crap. So what we did, we've got, the actual term for it is a classic plus mobile home. Two bedroom, sleep six, but we've got that. It's only cost 138 quid for four days. Can't knock it, can you? Can't knock it. It's because the weather was just going to be yeah, rubbish, the wasn't it? Been crap for camping. It we got the crap. tent and everything, didn't we, Bo? We are stopping. Uh, it's called Dune Blanche in a place called Camilleurs. But while we're there, we're going to. I don't know if anybody watched this, but we watched it on TV. My fair loved it, and I've ended up getting into it. That escape to the chateau uh, with Dick and Angel. It's only about a couple of hours from there, so we are going to have a mooch if we can get a picture outside. I know it's a bit thing, but it's, it's just something doing it. So weather permitting, we're going to have a meet up there. You never know. Nice advice in for a brew. Yeah, right. <laughs> I, wouldn't I wish. I wouldn't invite me in for a brew. <laughs> anyway, folks, go get on the road and we'll uh, show you the videos from France soon. Come here, you. Monty, come here. How are we doing? Anyway, folks, sorry for rushing off then. I was dying for a cough. Not been well at all the last couple of days. Of all times, eh? All the bloody times. But yeah, anyway, thanks for watching this. Uh, the videos will be up for France probably the week after. We go tomorrow, Sunday, we come back Wednesday. We might even stop somewhere on the way back in another hotel that way home. She, she might stay Wednesday. Yeah, if we can sort the, the old childcare situation out, uh, we might stop in a bit of a South Wales job or somewhere on the way back. But we will, we will sort it out, we'll sort it out. Anyway, folks, thanks for watching this. Uh, if you like it, subscribe. If you don't, well, you don't. Thank you.